the war is not over. Even if Yemen is not on the news, now they need our help more than ever. I was in Yemen around 2015. That was my last mission. In 2015, the civil war just started. And we had a team on the ground. Due to the war, the team was unable to get out. So they needed a surgical team to relieve the existing staff there. I was part of the first surgical team that arrived there during the war. We were managing and running a trauma center in Aden. The fighting was very close to the hospital. Aden is a, a not so big city. The front line was right in the city. So you, you really have a lot of civilians caught in the middle. We had so many gunshot wound patients. We had another patient. He was shot by a sniper. And he was one of the most difficult patients that I've had. But he was one of my favorite patients in ICU. He had the worst injuries, but despite the war, the dire situation, he always had a smile on his face. So I'm still reminded of his optimism. After my mission, he requested our local doctor to send me a picture. And he said, please send it to Dr. Karina so that she knows I'm okay. So that she will not worry. One week after he sent the picture, he passed away. In some areas, it may be quiet, but the conflict is still there. Now they need our help more than ever.